I don't know. Oh, okay. Can I ask me? Maybe. Morning, Zach. Morning. How are you? Very well. In the last video, when I said that was the last time I see Zach before Christmas, it's a lie, because it's the next day, uh, and I'm going to see Radu today, the physio that I work with over in, uh, how do I say it, Worcester, so bloody miles away, eight hour round drive for me. Zach's coming with me today, so I stopped over here last night, we're going to do a little workout this morning, I'm going to make sure I do some rehab, and then we're going to go and see Radu, he's going to have a look at Zach's feet, uh, as well as uh, my second bout of treatment for my host of issues, and I can inform him how I got on with the podiatrist, and what I found out with my feet, bones, legs longer, all that kind of great stuff. I'm doing 15 front squats, 15 burpees over bar, 10, 10, 5, 5, rest 2 minutes, Three rounds and depending on time, 30 in broken wall balls straight into a um, thousand meter bike curve, rest two minutes, three rounds. How was that, Zach? Very leggy. I'm shattered after that. I, did, I went so far. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> This might apply to a bunch of you guys. The one thing I've found from my squats is that my gastrocnemius are tight. So that's your calf muscles, like the big ones you see on the back. And if they're tight, they're gonna stop you being able to. It's my foot and my head's my shin. It stopped me being able to do that. And I wanna make that angle less so I can get my knees further forward in the squat and be able to get deeper into the squat without having to lean forward at the chest. One thing that happens with my squats when it gets very heavy is it ends up being a good morning, I start to lean over. And that happens because I haven't got the angle in my ankles to allow my knees to track forward and my body to stay upright. It means my body tries to compensate. As a result, the balls of my feet are really pushing hard into the floor to stop myself tipping forwards, which means my calves get super pumped. So at the moment, my calves are hurting more than ever. And that's why, so after seeing the podiatrist yesterday, one of the things he said was about doing cyclist squats, so cycling, uh, squatting with the plate under your heels to lift your heels, or use your weightlifting, uh, weightlifting shoes, which is all good and well, and I, and I will do that at certain times, but today's barefoot squats, because I'm really just trying to get that kind of, that whole positioning better, uh, and keep releasing off my calves on top. Analyzing your movement can be really hard, even if you know a little bit about the body and how it moves, there's just so many things that you don't know, or I don't know, that you think you know, and, and, and things that you think are the cause and they're not, they're a byproduct of something else happening. It's always good to film your stuff and get someone else to look through it, um, or even go and pay to see someone. I mean, I've had stuff that I've put up on these videos before and people said, John, have you thought about this? Have you seen that? And they've been right. Like, there's lots of things going on. Um, so do take the time to film your, film your lifts and have a look through them. Come on, Zach, you can get in. Who cocks this close? Ridiculous! <laughs> oh. Oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> oh. He is in. Uh, okay, really, really tough morning of training for me. I don't know how I got through it. Uh, got you some. You got me some. Zach, what is this? Just bananas and tang oh, tangerines everywhere. Yeah. Uh, we are off to Worcester now to see Radu. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, so we're now heading to see Radu. Uh, my second appointment, Zach's gonna get his feet looked at. Can we just make a point of how far back Zach sits? He can barely reach his steering wheel. We are playing the song game. Zach's been talking big game for a few days, thinking he's gonna beat me when he has not got a chance. We've got Spotify on shuffle, whatever song comes up, first person to get the song and the artist. I think you should have one shot at the song and artist. Okay. Batman scoop. Oh, oh time oh, oh. oh. Now you got it wrong though. It's not Frisky! Right. Now you've got you can't. Tiny temper! Yeah, but it, yeah, it's tiny temper, but you didn't get the song Frisky. Oh, <laughs> you get one point. Oh, what a so it's three all. Oh, what a waste! What a waste! I see girls. Here, there, and everywhere. Oh. Short skirts, long skirts, love when they walk. It's called I See Girls, so we'll have the point for that. <laughs> Stars in their eyes. Oh! Just Jack. Oh. Yeah, let's go 5 4. Oh, it's like that. Is it moving to New York by the Wombats? Seven, four. So we've decided to do 10 points in each genre. This is pop classic. Go get through this, go get through this, one each. Uh, <laughs> Eight, five. Craig David walking away. No seven no, days. No, you bet. Match point to JC. Craig David, Craig come David. in. Oh, oh, 
Shall we just go to like an 11 5? Pop round one by I'd me. Like, I'd like to say I'm driving, which is definitely hindering my reaction skills. <laughs> Rhyme Classics. Rhyme Classics. Yeah, if I don't win this, I'm quitting the game. You're definitely going to win this, but... Yeah. Oh, big tune! Oh, wow, Danny Temple Wifey, jeez! Yeah, you love this, don't you? Yeah? Four nil! Seven nil. Motown, here we go. Shuffle play. D Stevie Wonder, Sir Duke. Da -da 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 two points to me. Woo! Marvin Gaye. Grapevine. Oh no, have I misheard that? Yeah, oh mate, I got that before that f***er even came in. 6-1. Oh, what a banger! Do you not know this? I used to feel... You make me feel like a natural woman and I'm a reaper prank. We're here. Zach got his ass kicked on the, uh, on the game. I was appalling at grime, everything else, hip-hop, I want it all. Slowly, get your knees out as much as possible, yes. and go nice and slowly down. But don't forget the knees, the, the heels, heels on the floor, okay? And knees out. Keep the heel on the floor, don't forget about the heel on the floor. Try to keep the heel now, I'm yeah. sit right back. Yeah, sit right back, doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. I just want to start. I forgot to feel my, just listening to Radu, just talk through my stuff, explained what happened at the podiatrist, really cool. He's now talking to Zach and like, just found so much stuff out already for him to kind of build stuff back to help with his super flat feet so he can get deeper in his squats so he can get over the tendonitis, fasciitis, all kinds of stuff. You need to do that as much as possible. Yeah. You know, hold on to that and just try to challenge that dorsiflexion every time. Yeah. Try to challenge your ankle mobility. Try to ch push, push, push through that toe yeah. to try to keep that ankle open, not collapsed. Yeah. Yeah, especially on the left. When I was um, did in that low squat, why was it when I stood up, I got pain like here yeah. between this week? Why is that? Oh, that's, that's, that's the 80 band rubbing against the uh, epicondyle of the femur. That's why it's grinding there because it's, it's, it's obviously this is inflamed. It's a lot of work to do on you. <laughs> I'll be honest. No, mate, you haven't. You haven't. Automatically they saw you flat feet. Yeah, and they said. Pain through there, plantar fasciitis. Yeah. And you got the muscle that goes through there and goes and inserts all the yeah, way. Yeah, I said, yeah. Okay, so that's the one. But it's not this one, it's actually this one. Yeah, that's where, it, yeah. There we go, big buddy. So what, what is it, just? It's a muscle, it's a tendon. Like inflamed or was it? Yeah, because of like, obviously, the, the way you step in, it compensating from for the, the poor ankle stability in there. Oh, the one, this is the one, the flexor halogis longus. That's the badger. I never heard someone with plantar fasciitis having like shooting pains down in there because plantar fasciitis gets what it's Out to the foot, isn't it? Cover, yeah. It covers the plantar fascia, which is this one. Yeah. Yeah. And most of the times you would feel it, someone with flat feet like yours in the heel, would feel it in the yeah. heel and in this area in here, mostly coming into there. But no, you, you, you describe a completely different pain. Zach's asking what I'm having done with this bursitis. Bursa already calmed down a little bit. He's Tendons already calmed down a bit, so go down, go down as much as possible. Now fight with your ankle pronation a little bit. And just get someone to do that with you, yeah? Okay, yeah. So now again, another test if your glutes are working from there. Stand up, straight up, push up, push up, push up. Oh, <laughs> mate, <laughs> nothing there, is there? Yeah. See? <laughs> Two silverbacks. Silverback, make silverback. Still back. Radu, show us the back of your top. I haven't actually said hello because I started the camera up late. I apologise. There he is. Silver back himself. Uh, hello, by the way, and, and, and goodbye, I guess. Thank, thank you for all your help. My pleasure. And then he won at least for the drive home. Obviously tropical. Broski, I'm heading off. How did you find Radu? Really good. Yeah, tell me uh, I've got weak glutes in a very low squat position and it's giving me exercises to do but yeah I'm doing them now I do them every other day I find I always go too hard on stuff I get given and it just gives me some sort of other problem yeah, so yeah I'm just gonna 
easy to do. I've got to do a lot of barefoot stuff, which makes me nervous. Only for the warm up, though. Yeah. And it's, oh, it's, I would, I would, I wouldn't. Even if you said lifting your barefoot, I wouldn't. No, no, no. I would never do it's, that. He's not going to ask you. That. It's a yeah. positioning stuff, isn't it? Yeah. So like stuff like this, I'm just going to yeah. do, and then. Uh, Softies. Yeah. Awesome, alright bro, I'm gonna shoot. Yeah, mesh when you get back. Yeah, we'll do that. Traffic time has gone up, uh, so I'm just gonna spend half an hour doing some kind of power snatch technique with Zach. Then I'm gonna do the drive home when hopefully traffic's not quite so busy because there's no point just standing it stuck in traffic wasting all my fuel. We've just been spending time, because both Zach and I have uh, tendonitis in one knee with some IT band issues and glute med issues. Every time we were hitting the catch and our snatch, our right knees were just going boop, boop, in a little bit. So Zach's last one he hit and the last one I hit. He didn't do it at all, mine did it way less. So I'm gonna keep working on that, trying to think about it. They're broke against me, it's tough still. Just go. Try to jump high before it's getting up to time. I'm out this time, big man. No. Thanks for today. Always a pleasure. Love you. See you soon. Yeah, I'll let, I'll let you out.